What did you like most about this Liverpool performance this evening? I think the fact that coming into this game, uh, there was a lot of talk of, of Leicester maybe ending this unbeaten run or Liverpool dropping points. And, and to me, psychologically, it feels like a big win. I think James Milner's just mentioned now, it almost feels like the season starts now. And not just this season, but every season. Once you get the international football out the way, you can get into a real run, real momentum. I mean, we may start seeing what we normally expect from a lot of teams in the Premier League now, then it's not so much uh, stop-start. But it did feel like a big win. Uh, really, it was up against Leicester. And the fact that uh, Man City, who for me are still Liverpool's biggest rivals, I'm sure there'll be more people involved in, in the title race this season. And I hope that is the case, because I think that's what's been great about the Premier League this season, different people at the top of the table. But I still feel Liverpool and Manchester City are still the, the teams to beat in this uh, season. And the fact that Liverpool have won and City have lost uh, yesterday, I think puts them in a good position uh, considering you know, where Man City started the season. What do you think Liverpool and City have got that the likes of Spurs and Chelsea don't, Jamie? Better players, uh, better teams. Uh, listen, let's not just dismiss. We're only eight games into this season, eight to nine games. Let's not dismiss what we've seen over the last two or three years. I hope those teams you've just mentioned make uh, a better fist of it this season. Uh, we've said about uh, points totals not being what they will be before, but I still think those two teams... Uh, have the best managers. I think they have, well, certainly in City's case, uh, one of the best squads. And Liverpool have proven that today, that, you know, we're a few people out. Uh, they can still cope. But there's no doubt, I think Chelsea look like they've invested well. I think Jose Mourinho now, 12 months in, is certainly getting his grips onto that team as well. And it should be a lot more competitive uh, this season. But you just can't still forget what City and uh, Liverpool have done for these last two or three years. So for me, they, they are still the, you know, the teams to beat. And it's still a long way to go. Still, you know, 29, 30 games to go. Leicester could have gone top if they'd managed to, to win at Anfield tonight. And yes, it was a, a tall order given uh, how long Liverpool had been unbeaten there. Um, Freddie talked about them being passive at half time. What did you make of their approach? Yeah, I mean, listen, I, I agree with that. That's right. But it, I think it's difficult to be critical of Leicester when they, they set up the way they have done in all the other away games and they've had success. So if they win those games by you know, scoring goals on the counter-attack, and we say it's uh, you know, brilliant from Rodgers, tactically fantastic, and then it doesn't happen here today, and Liverpool play really well and win, we say he got his tactics wrong. It's, we can't just say you know, tactically they got it wrong just because of the result. You've got to look at the performance. I think Liverpool handled Jamie Vardy and Madison extremely well. And that's the big difference. You think of how Leicester set up at Man City, really deep, really passive, and they end up winning the game, I think, 5-2 in the end. And... That's the difference. Liverpool are the best team at stopping teams playing through them. That, that, that's why they win the ball back so often. And that's the big problem for Man City at this moment. And, and possibly what we saw yesterday as well at Tottenham, that they're not as good in those certain situations. And the other teams, they beat Arsenal and Leeds. They're coming up against a different proposition here in Liverpool. You know, the champions and still, I think, even at this early stage, have still put in the best performances that we've seen from certain teams in the league this season. So they are still the team to beat. So it was always going to be tougher at Anfield for Leicester than it was at any other uh, a way fix you this season. Jamie, thank you for the moment. Freddie, you can, you can turn back for the moment. Faces. I've got to get ready for MNF. <laughs> 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 okay, Freddie, you can,